you can make an absolutely amazing grilled meatloaf, especially when you flavor it with three of our essential seasoning blends, garlic garlic, onion onion, and seasoned salt. And wrapping it in bacon doesn't hurt. Start by preheating your grill for medium heat. I have my meat mixture all ready to go here, so I'll just pat this into shape, and it helps to wet your hands first. I'm going for a loaf that's about eight inches by four inches. Now we're gonna wrap this in some low sodium bacon. Making a lattice top sounds kind of hard, but it's actually really easy. I have seven strips of bacon that I'm gonna layer on using a diagonal overlapping pattern. For this recipe, it helps to have a two-part grill pan, like this one. I've lined the bottom with foil for easy cleanup. And just for fun, I'm going to surround my meatloaf with some cubed potatoes that I tossed with a little oil and some seasoned salt and garlic pepper. Okay, our beautiful meatloaf is ready to go, so let's head out to the grill. I'm going to turn my grill down to low. Low and slow is the way to go for grilled meatloaf because this will take about 45 minutes to an hour to cook. I'll keep the lid down, but I'm going to check it frequently with my instant read thermometer. Okay, this is at about 150 degrees, so I'm gonna glaze this with a little maple syrup and then let it cook for another five minutes or so. I want this to be 160 degrees. Doesn't that look gorgeous? Bacon wrapped grilled meatloaf is easy and amazingly delicious. Now that's tastefully simple. Mm -hmm.